I really fell into regulatory by accident. So after completing my PhD, I took a contract role at GSK in, in a CMC role. So really my first entrance into regulatory affairs and had no idea, honestly, what regulatory affairs was, but really loved it. And it gave me a sense of the complexity and the breadth of, of roles and the type of um, career opportunities within a research and development uh, group within a pharma company. And I love regulatory affairs, I love the, the diversity, the different, um, the, the strategic thinking, the, the tasks, and every day is different. So it's a great career. I'd advise anyone who wants to get into regulatory affairs to consider doing a life science degree or pharmacy degree if you want to go into the pharma company or in med tech or on the engineering side, but to get a really good grounding in a scientific uh, degree. And then to just look at taking roles across all different aspects of regulatory affairs, so thinking about starting in either early development or, or uh, life cycle management of, of products and just really work through those different types of regulatory activities to get a good grounding in the full breadth of the product life cycle.